Next, we head far away from the city to a remote place high in the mountains of Armenia, where a construction project designed to revitalize a popular but hard-to-get-to tourist spot may end up setting a new world record. Yerkiri Media's Gayani Avetisiania tells us why developers are in suspense. The Pearl of Mountains, that's what locals call the Datev Monastery here in southern Armenia. Tourists make their way to the 9th century monastery fortress complex through a gorge with steep rocky slopes. But a high-tech transportation system will soon be built, the world's longest aerial tramway. This is called a double reversible tramway, aerial tramway. And so they're, they're coming to the opposite directions. And in each cabin there will be about 25 passengers. The 5.7-kilometer tramway is supported by three towers between its two terminals. The highest point is said to be 330 meters above ground. There are two suspension cables and one propulsion cable for each tram, allowing both trams to operate at the same time. Construction is nearly complete with the cooperation of the Italian Renko and Swiss Caraventa companies, and the opening ceremony will be in November. When we uh, initially started the project, it was about creating a cultural and touristic uh, attraction. Uh, it was about renovating the monastery, working with the local communities, and then when we re realized that access to the monastery of Datev is one of the biggest issues in the region, uh, the idea of the tramway came up, and, it, uh, and after the fact, once we had designed it, we realized that it's actually one of the longest, and it turned out the longest, aerial tramway uh, in the world. The project has local villagers buzzing, many of whom raise cattle and don't have permanent employment. They say hotel and restaurants will be built with the aerial tramway. Young people of our village will have jobs. I hope that this project will somehow make our life better. Right now I work on tramway construction as a mechanic. I earn about 300 US dollars per month and it is enough to support my family. Poor roads in this mountainous region have made it difficult to get around quickly. That's set to change too. To travel from the village of Halidzor to Batha village by car, it took us around an hour. From now on the inhabitants of this area and the tourists from all over the world will have the opportunity to pass this road only in 11 minutes with the aerial tramway top speed at 37 kilometers per hour. The Guinness Book of World Records still has to certify that this is the longest aerial tramway in the world and the organization has been notified. Bayanavetisyan, Kid Media, Armenia for CNN Worldview.